only hard work makes a fight easy. And there is no greater danger than underestimating your opponent. I've never been one to underestimate anyone. The way in today, it's about like nine o'clock right now and I have to make it to the event for 12 o'clock. I had a good training session yesterday. My corner is amazing this time. Uh, we have a good game plan. Um, yeah, we're gonna go there, get some work done and hopefully walk away with that W because I do head home tomorrow from Indonesia back to Canada. Um, well, not tomorrow, but the next day after the fight. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna take it easy, fill it out, feel a little bit groovy. And yeah, one day at a time. And uh, Made Alta, all right, you guys get ready, so get ready for this. He'll win this fight, you will see. <laughs> His boxing, kickboxing is very good, and Jiu Jitsu, grappling, came out perfect for MMA. Good luck, bro. 77, okay, new champion in Bali. This is the first cage event here in Bali. And unfortunately, it's raining a lot today. We're about to do the weigh-in. Um, we've been training really hard for this, to be honest. Uh, it's a nice way to end it, being the fact that I'm gonna be heading back home the next day after the fight, so we're gonna get that W. And uh, yeah, guys, it's been a lot of good work. I have some great people in my corner. Um, Dean, the head of the UFC Institute in Shanghai, will be cornering me. They have a really good game plan for my opponent. I know a little bit about him, not too much. Um, so we're gonna go take it simple, work on it, you know, low slip jabs, work on it, you know, take it down. And uh, it'll be a solid one, to be honest. Hey, 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 that's what How you doing? How you doing? That right there? That's the man, that's the man right there. Actually, yo. He's actually done so much for me. He's uh, one of the uh, one of the owners of Bali MMA. Great guy. Um, done quite a lot for me, truthfully, especially this month because I got to train for a huge discounted price because of him. So I honestly big shout out to him. This is his event, as well as the two other brothers, and uh, we're ready. Seventy-six point three makes weight. Next up in the red corner, Martin. All right, this is fight number seven. M M M 
Just finished weighing in, I weighed in at 76 point something. Um, it's always important to talk about how you feel. I feel okay to be honest, last time when I fought, I felt a difference just because there was a lot less support, but I've gained a lot of really good relationships since I've been here. And uh, I feel really good. Um, I'm not really bothered. I'm always gonna feel weird whenever I'm looking next to somebody or looking people in the eyes. So that's just awkward for me, but like I'm not the kind of person to talk a lot. Um, I just feel like, do what I do, basically simple as that. I feel good, everything was good so far. The, the venue is looking absolutely amazing. And uh, yeah, I'm hungry. I came from the mud, there's dirt on my hands. Strong like a tree, there's roots where I stand. Good rounds. 
UFC level guys here, yeah, that's giving you massive confidence. These guys are gonna have nothing on any of those guys here. Yeah. Stay relaxed, enjoy yourself, you let, your shot, you let, you let your shots go, you to take down when you need it, but just see what's out there, relax, yeah, take your time, take your time. Because remember, it's if you're training to fight and not fighting, it's like studying for a test and not doing the test. 